Welcome to Club Wisdom, mate. The new update is coming, and if you remember anything, as it's Christmas, if you remember the last Christmas update, we had a voucher or a coupon last Christmas. If you remember, it was Xmas 2021, so be prepared after the update probably to try Xmas 2022. Let's see what happens for that. And um, last year's event was um, they actually made I think five new farming areas and you could farm and you could get like polar bears and Santas and you could swap them for uh, gold and you also had a Christmas box I think and it included um, soul weapon like you know the things to enhance it so um, actually uh, and also skin you could also have a skin ticket or up to 50 or something like not not gacha like you could actually just pull for that so actually going by last Christmas that was really good so what I'm expecting this Christmas is pretty um, I have a high expectation but I know it's gonna probably get ruined however if you remember guys the last update we had like this convenience update this way to make the game improved or whatever actually um I'm quite impressed. I really, I really like this um, last update. So well done, well done to the developers. Okay, so good on them. All right, let's um have a look. So normal banners are up. Um, normal, normal people. Um, oh, are you a fan of green? Because it's look at how much greenery we have. So goodness yeah I always forget four orcs it's like if you don't want orcs this is like the last banner you want so that might be like what kind of Christmas is that um, am I expecting a Christmas skin I'm just asking myself that question as I don't have twitch um, yeah <laughs> I don't know there's probably not gonna be one okay mm. Christmas winter prep ends okay so let's see the latest package a limited time event package okay is it gonna be super cheap and guys if you remember the secret shop that's been on like giving you 300 gems every day I mean I mean we've had it really good I'll be honest with you I mean it's been um, I mean it's been quite amazing so for this package I'm looking for anything in particular 50 premium enhancement scrolls I'm thinking, what is what are fifty? Because then they can't. You can't literally be paying that price for fifty scrolls. That what are they? Wait a minute, premium enhancement scrolls. Wouldn't they be the scrolls that are for weapons? And when it says premium, please don't tell me at the moment. Our weapons gonna uh, is gear and weapons gonna go to level twenty five now. <laughs> what are premium enhancement scrolls? Does the next one give it soul weapon enhancement material? No, nothing on no, not premium. Okay, so that must be something I probably know, but got no idea. And then character initialization tickets. Um, that that doesn't necessarily mean reset, does it? Um. Okay, it looks like, are you telling me this update is going to be pretty huge? And are we going to get the new caves that are going to be coming out? So is everything happening now? There's a lot of things on that I'm, yeah, that I'm looking forward to, but I don't know. So 200 premium enhancement scrolls. Please, if premium enhancement scroll means 15, level 15 upwards, I just doubt it. And why doesn't the second why doesn't package two give this premium enhancement scroll? I'm so confused. Okay, what's going to happen? Okay, event package. Event package. You can purchase it once per account. Okay, these are normally really good. Okay, the end period will be no. Okay, Dark Kurumi support package. What? 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 no this is not the kind of package I was thinking and oh sorry this event package sucks and no one wants Dark Karumia I think we're at the stage where like if we we've been so lucky with these Black Friday boxes that no one the last thing we want is a Dark Karumia package if anything everyone just wants to finish Darker Loose 
No one wants this. What are they doing? Okay, so what? It's, well, it's clearly not a skin, is it? It's not a skin. How much orc can I deal with? What kind of Christmas is this? Santa has become a green orc. Um, 200 snowflakes. Oh, so, okay, so we'll drop in all stages. So there's no new stage for Christmas. There's no new Christmas stage. Okay, you can participate in arena as an event item. Okay, so, and Golden King Coin. So, so, so it's exactly the same as the current event. <laughs> okay, so the question is, okay, fine. What are we going to get? Do they even realize it's Christmas? I guess they do, because maintenance is on Unboxing Day. You can participate in this event by touching the arena icon in town. Yes. Event items, yeah. Okay, one. this time it will be a 1v1 match. Okay, so one-on-one, -on -one, I guess. Okay. Um, so who's going to win? What, Kurumi? <laughs> okay, so if you match the winning, the, it says nothing changed. Okay, so please tell me that. Okay, what's coming next? Oh, okay, the store event items, character reset ticket, Christmas event gift box. Oh, really? Really? Okay. I want to know what's in those gift boxes. Okay, this is great. Because I'll tell you why this is very important. Because I was planning on, um, in a few hours time, I was just going to use like a thousand skip tickets and get loads more stuff to open the um, Black Friday gift boxes. But now that the Christmas event are having a gift box, I don't need to, yeah, I'll wait and see what this is about. So this is this is actually very important. Um, hero, soul, weapon, summon, scroll. Okay, so okay, so all the normal stuff, soldier, once per account for the whole time, chiefy. But um, legendary, weapon, scroll, yes, the same. Supreme enhancement scrolls. My god, it's called Supreme. And the other one was called premium. I need to see these premium. Oh, enchantment. I want to know what those premium ones are above. I'm really getting worried now. Um, God. Um, okay. Uh, artifacts box. Da, 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 da. Um, I don't see anything new here. That worries me. Damn it. Damn it. Korean. Give me a second. I'll beat them. One second later, um, okay, so here, okay, so let's have a quick look. So hero option ticket, hero select ticket. Now, that is good, especially if you haven't got the new match girl. Um, I would really say based on the next hero, if we're going to get one soon or not, I would say save the rest of them. Um, hero summon ticket. So... Okay, so we've got Hero Select. We've got Purple Ticket. Wow. That's that's an improvement, I guess. Unless you need Alus and Kurumi. Legendary Equipment Item Summon Scroll. Hmm. That's quite nice. One Character Initialization Ticket. Does that mean Reset Ticket? No idea. Superlative trans, yeah, transcendence, nothing new there. Two artifacts, everything's the same. A dog, yeah, a real dog. I just clicked on it, and all I'm seeing is our dogs. Um, soul weapon enhancement, summon scroll for a dog. Okay, uh, summon hero, soul weapon enhancement materials. Okay, so. Okay, I'm not seeing anything about this premium business. I'm get, I'm still worried about the premium. Like, okay, so nothing there. Hero upgrade stone, weapon refining. Okay, I don't see anything different. God, uh, is gear really going to be on level 25? Okay, so based on that, let's continue down. I mean, yeah, it's nice, but no skin tickets. There's zero skin tickets compared to last year. So clearly the developers have forgotten some of the good things of last year. So um, Christmas is just a normal 
day, which is a shame. Um, items, yeah, for drawing, yeah. Okay, catch the new event, GM Lena. Ooh, what's this? A new event map is added. Oh, you can enter through the catch <laughs> Game Master Lena icon in plan. Okay, so if you don't know who Lena is, Lena is actually the actual, the actual developer of the game. If you look at my old videos, there's one that says fans only. If you look in the special video playlist, you can find out more about GM Lena. And he set out what the game's going to be like. Um, he had one interview, then I explained. Um, that's funny. Um, the event map consumes... Okay, so there is a new event map. So there really is one. Oh, it really is. Five difficulty levels. It really is happening. Oh, wait. Oh, damn it. Really? Christmas gold items. Legendary items. No way. 15 to 20% probability. What? What? Can we skip map? Can we skip? But four shoes. No wonder. So they increased the shoe price, but... Oh my god, really? So, so if you're on the fifth difficulty level, probably 20% probability, the lowest one, 15%. Oh man, oh man. Legendary items, 20%. Do you, what, what? No way. No way. That's unbelievable. Oh my god. This update. What? Oh, oh, what, what, what? Twice a day. No wonder. Consumes four shoes and can be entered twice a day. Oh, that's no wonder. I was thinking I could just farm it all day. Okay, so two times. Just make sure you can just pass the fifth difficulty level twice a day. Okay, so we... Okay, so twice a day, so oh, so theoretically, for every five times, you're definitely going to, you should definitely. So shouting no way, no way managed to make me break my speaker. So I'm back again. Um, yeah, this is great. Um, twice a day. I'm very happy with Christmas and great, great, great. Um, uh, I, I hope. I even hope they could like do it three or four times. I hope they could do it more. <laughs> okay. So if they did it five times a day, at least you would definitely get a legendary item every day. That would make my Christmas come true. But I don't think that probability could be only for legendary items. It will probably include gold items, but they're commemorative. So I don't know, like maybe they're things you want to keep forever. Now there's a new user package. I'm, I'm very impressed with what they do for new users. So I, I really, I, I will start up an account and have a look at that or see if it comes up in the old account, but it says we can't buy. Who knows? I want to know what is this package, how much it costs and what they give. Why do I have a feeling it's going to be a great package? It's going to be like giving six Mercedes and six Tories or something. Who knows? And, oh, there is a hero skin. That's actually quicker. They don't normally release a skin update after update because last time we had Vical. A lot, of, a lot of pros were very happy with that. But um, a new Christmas blue skin. I don't know why it's blue, and I can't imagine who a blue skin is for. I mean, who's left? Who's left to buy a skin for? Um, don't know. I got, I got no idea. But Christmas blue, um, let's take a look. But I can guarantee it's going to be a female. It, it must be because it's, I don't know. They always do Christmas and females. Here we go. What? What is that? Is that Sean? Is his sword? It's Beast. What is this? Honestly, I'm confused. With a, it's a male, so I was completely wrong about the female. Um, what? What is that? It is Sean, right? Anyway, I'll, I'll find out, but it's, um, what? Chippy, chippy style. It doesn't even say anything. You really? Really? Christmas blue skin. 
It's not even blue. I'm confused. Isn't it Christmas red skin? I, I got no idea what it is, but um, I got no idea why it's blue. But anyway, um, I, I'm guessing it's Sean's skin. I don't remember if Sean has a skin, but um, yeah, okay, I'll, I'll, I'll buy it. Um, ho, ho, ho. Okay. Um, oh, about, oh, oh, 68 to 70. Okay, I hope they add to the developer, GM Lena, please add some story this time. You, okay, let me, let me tell you, I'm very happy, but let me tell you, from like 60 to 67, it's like, you can kind of tell it was kind of rushed because it's only like one, it's, you can only, it's only like one group. It's like, there's no two groups, there's no three groups, it's just one group. It's like, and some of it doesn't even have a story. So, I, I really hope that like some story has been added. And I will update my story videos. It's just I haven't updated them. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Underground cave, it's ready. The very hard, oh. First to 40 floors. Underground den cave title, difficult. Damn it, the cave has, yes, okay. So the cave is finally here very difficult cave or chaos cave whatever you want to call it okay 40 floors that's another 400 shoes um wow wow okay i'm i'm happy it's a start new soldiers what non wait wait what is going on this update is pretty amazing amazon and yeah, Empire, non-army soldiers, non-army soldiers, flyers. Oh my god, Empire flyers. All right, I want to see, is that, it? okay, please tell me this Empire flyer is a magician one, and they're going to, and they're going to change all the efficacies and stuff. Like, is it, I, I re okay, can't wait to see what this is. Again, they're not showing it. They used to show these things. Okay, uh, hero balance changes. Damn it, there's so many things happening. Okay, brilliant. Um, hero balance. Okay, let's see who they're focusing on. So the developers are really like trying to upgrade everyone who is not a were beast. <laughs> so let's have a look. Um, Anna. Oh, Jen. Oh, so it's. Oh, I was gonna say it's. Yeah. Okay, Amazon. Elf. That is elf, is it? Or Jackan. Whatever. Okay, let's see. Change from... Okay, Anna. Lightning bow. Sorry, who's Anna? I thought Anna was the Wonder Woman. Because there's no Anna with a lightning bow. Who's this? Am I going mad? Physical attack power has changed from... It's not Anna, is it? 300, 600 to 300 to 800. Electrocution time has changed from... Okay, maybe... Yeah, she does electrocute. Yeah, I guess it is. Oh, blow. Bloody Nora. I read it wrong. I, I thought it was bow. I I'm actually going mad. Okay, okay. Yeah, it really is Anna. And, um... I see. So that... You know what? This is... Is this, like, her third in balance update? It's like... Is it... You know what? It's because, right, the Japanese ranking placed, like, Anna as, like, one of the best in the game it's like they're just trying to make the japanese happy i'm sure um electrocution time is and they increase the electrocution time. i mean okay i'm gonna say based on this mm, i might use her in um arena I might start considering her. Okay, then Jenny. Physical attack power of Hero's tactical weapon. The whatever boomerang is changed. Okay. Uh, okay, I, I do like Jenny. And um, I actually spent like 10k of gems getting her soul weapon. I really like Jenny. And I use her to farm. I still use her in farming. I'm using her right now as we speak. I think Jenny is um, underrated. And I think I think it's great that um, they're doing something to make her stronger. So 
Okay, good. Good for me, anyway. <laughs> um, physical attack power of the heroes, tactical skill. Okay, Seria. I mean, my favourite unit has been changed from 300 to 400. E brilliant. Oh, yeah. Um, okay. And I like how, like, Kirks is not there. So, um, Seria, okay, might actually... That's actually, like, look, that's double. <laughs> I mean, I... And, you know, she's going to freeze people as well. I'm looking forward to, yeah, trying her out as well. I mean, as she is my favourite. Um, okay, Sifa, so Silfa or whatever. They're really doing the bow users. Um, this will be the second buff. I can't deal with how bad this unit is. Although on paper it looks alright. Okay, physical attack has been changed from, yeah, it doesn't matter. Of the heroes. Okay, active skill. Yes, yeah, they're just changing power. Activation cooldown. Archer's Pride has been changed from when the enemy is defeated to when the enemy takes... No way. Ye oh my god. Oh, shites. Oh, oh my god. If this is what I think it is... Okay, let me tell you. Right, the thing is, if she... It's a she. I, I was going to say I've checked. I haven't checked, but you know what I mean. It's, okay, this Sylphia, she's supposed to give, like, your archers a buff when she kills. The problem is she can't kill anything. But now, if she just has to um give any enemy damage, she be, she's now she's now a viable buffer to all your archers. She's now become something OP. Um, this, this is, this is crazy. Um, if this is the, I'm sure it is Archer's Pride. I'm sure this is the, um, this is, this is the skill. I'm sure. Um, this is it. Oh, um, oh, wow. Um, definitely a rank increase if I'm correct on this. Okay. If I'm not, I'll write in the comments. Okay. Zenus. Why out of all days, I forgot who he is. <laughs> um, the attack range, attack range, okay, Zenus, Zenus, uh, of the heroes, they have such crap names, Shield Strike, Shield Strike, it's like, what is he, Captain America, changed from single to a wide area, why can I not remember who he is, oh, oh, because with an X, he's the Empire, Oh, oh my god, he's on a wide error. He's going to stun them for ages. Yeah, you've got to remember this Zenus was absolutely rubbish. He's abs He absolutely sucks because you can actually have a weapon that does the same as his ultimate skill. That's how ridiculously stupid he was. And um, what's the weapon? Um, you know the weapon that stuns as a weapon? Um, I think it's, a, it's the green sword. Anyway, it could do exactly the same, literally, as what he does. Now, by doing a wide area, he's finally going to be viable um, for an ultimate. But we need to calculate and see how wide the area is. The cooldown is changed from 8 seconds to 12, so it's a longer, okay, longer cooldown, but 12 seconds is still fine. And a short charge is added. He can charge in. This big fat guy can now charge. Okay, great. He He's like, um, he's like that guy, that guy everyone used to pull in Fire, fire Emblem Heroes. Brilliant. Okay. Um, but I forgot that guy's name as well. Tiffany, when using the hero's tactical skill, what another update. Javelin throw, the evasion will be deleted again. You mean she s cancels out evasion? Is she like, like, what are they planning with her? If you got to understand, people are going for like 100% evasion at the moment. That's what, that's like the meta change everyone wants. And, um, if if she's the first to cancel out an evasion, now I'm thinking about it. Will there be weapons, anti-evasion weapons in the future? Mm. If that, I didn't even think the developers would consider cancelling out an evasion. That's big. Um, I still don't know anything about that premium um upgrade thingy, Jiggy. So all right, let's see. Guild raid. Oh. 14 levels have been added. Yeah, as expected. 
guild raid history view function has been added. Okay, so so guild raid had 13 levels. I can clear them. Our guild clears all of them, but now we have 14. Okay, that's a that's an that is better than what I was told would happen. I was told something else. So so this is um having 14 levels this is actually a better improvement. Commas have commas have been added for readability of killed raid bosses. Oh, we hired someone to help us with grammar. I got no idea. Guild member raid damage and guild ranking damage. Um Okay, so I don't really get it, but it looks like I like I, I like to I, I got no idea. That sounds sounds like such a small change, but it, it might be something interesting to see like what each person is doing in terms of damage, but I don't know. Okay, so let's see the bugs and fixes because generally the bugs and fixes have been very, very good. They've been worth a talk. Um Okay, so newcomer support package. All these support packages, yes, have been moved. Okay, yeah, yeah, move them. Okay, good. Accessory smelting stones have been added to the guild shop. Ah. Oh. Okay, so with level 14, they've moved. They've moved. Okay. Okay, I see. So, okay, that's good. That's good. The location of the dungeon icon in the town is changed to the top. Yep. Fix the... <laughs> who cares? Um, fix the bug where Kirk's serious active skills fan-shaped arrow deals damage once more. You see, this is quite important. Kirk's and Syria were secretly OP for the last few weeks, yet... Um, only only people who really um worked hard at trying to find out found that information they probably used that to their advantage in the arena so for instance what you can do is before the update maybe you can have a look and see what was happening with Kirk's and Syria's active skills fan shaped arrow blah blah you can actually see yourself that so actually Kirk's and Syria were a bit OP I guess um, an issue where the text order of the dungeon was fixed, whatever. Fix the bug where real-time score of Affinity War was displayed abnormally when changing the nickname. Hmm. Okay, got it. A bug where heal skills were not used um, in combat situations in defense mode has been fixed. Um. Oh my. So there has been a problem with healing. Goodness. Fix the issue where difficult enemies appeared mixed in the normal difficulty repeat map of stage 67. Okay. Fix the bug where there was no response when auto-equipping intermittently. Um, now that is a big improvement because I've honestly i it's been like it, it's been two months i've been waiting it's been too long they haven't fixed this i can't believe finally they're kind of fixing this is a big fix this is very important and you're going to see why later remember when you're auto equipping when you're pressing the auto equip button you're finally they're finally going to like override all the stuff you're equipping and find better stuff as as long as you haven't locked it like because currently the auto equip hasn't been working okay finally and that's the reason why i even changed the whole faction i had to change so much because of that so it's really unfair that we had to go like two months like that. Fixed a bug where underground troop formation information disappeared intermittently. They love intermittently. Yeah. Um, yeah, okay. No, okay. After the update, dungeon troop formation will be reset. Okay. Um, doesn't matter too much. The phenomenon of... Phenomenon. What is this? They started learning poetry. Of being pushed beyond the collider 
on the map okay on the knockback has been improved yeah i mean that's really irritating if you if you're using a bad emulator so about time they fix that modified to sell expired season pass coins 100 per gold piece okay that's some um, i don't know i, I think I, maybe i'd like to keep them as a memento if you're going to use high level words memento okay so this is um this is great this is um this is great. We're getting new soldiers, and it's looking like they're going to be flyers because they're non-army soldiers. Why can't I just say flyers? Um, so, so finally, we know everyone is going to get a flyer, and these flyers might be game-changing. So, really look and see what what's on offer with the flyers. Um, I do have a feeling they could be magicians, even, but um, we'll find out. Um, Everything is brilliant. Everything, everything is, um, everything is, yeah, pretty good. Um, I really think this is going to be a good Christmas. So everyone, please make sure you have a good Christmas. Please enjoy yourself. Um, we do talk every day. Like everyone's chatting on Discord in general. Um, and if if you can't find much, just look at the, all the previous posts. Everything is answered in Discord. Everything you need. Honestly, it's pretty impressive. So all the best, Club Wisdom Mate. Over and out. Uh, oh, do you want to like and subscribe? Do you? Do you? You can help me stay off the street, even though I'm I'm still on the street.